for me, if we're going to continue to see success and to move forward effectively, then we need to make sure we're grounded in the same things. That while we have autonomy in our classrooms and our teachers have that autonomy to build the classroom around their discipline and with their personality and with their strengths that they need to have, we also have to have grounding, founding principles that we as a district have agreed upon. The things that we, that we think are important. And for us, I mean, it's, we want to make sure we have those elements of student agency. We want to have personalized instruction. We want to have rigor. And we want to make sure we're using data. If we allow teachers that just jump in because they get so excited. We want that and we don't want to temper that, but at the same time we want to make sure we're focusing that. We're harnessing that enthusiasm and harnessing that energy to the direction that is the end goal and the vision for our district. But it is definitely going uh, beyond what we ever thought it would. Yes, we wanted to set some pillars, some, some basic guidelines of what every blended classroom would look like but we never want to take the autonomy of the decision making away from the classroom teacher. Kelly West opinion, nothing will ever replace the quality classroom teacher. We have a bunch of professionals that chose this profession because they love it, they're good at it. They need to be the number one decision maker in what goes on on the day-to-day -day process.